It's been an honor and privilege to be with uh, Cardinal McCarrick and uh, Bishop Chain and uh, former State Senator Larry Shaw uh, on this journey to Iran to engage in a religious diplomacy and also to seek the release of the two American fighters. We have been also guided uh, with the expertise and uh, leadership of Ambassador Miller uh, during our visit. Um, we, we have been promised that uh, our visit was productive and it helped accelerate the decision to release the hybrids. So we are grateful for, for the Iranian leadership uh, to facilitate that. But the bigger issue for us is also engaging our two countries in dialogue, in uh, humanitarian work, in theologian uh, dialogue that will lead our nation uh, to a better future away from confrontation and towards mutual understanding. Uh, so in short, while we were happy uh, that the decision was made to release them immediately, we were also hoping to bring them back with us. But as the, our colleagues already said, they are on our way. How long? We hope it will be very soon. Thank you. Uh, we're delighted to be back home. I spent a long week away, but as mediators, uh, we were bound by a code of silence to, to uh, help us in our work. But nevertheless, 30 days ago, our colleagues in Iran were sitting in prison facing eight years. But for the work that our group have, has done, uh, we're expecting an imminent release. For that, we all feel very grateful and very appreciative to the leadership of Iran, our leadership at the State Department, and all of our friends in, in the various NGOs. Now, for this, we're very fortunate, and we're pleased to be back home in America. Thank you.